Now we're seeing those mainly sunset skies out there right now. The radar is clear. However, we are going to be tracking some more rainfall in the forecast, not only today, but also tomorrow. Tomorrow's more widespread scattered uh, showers and storms. Today, we'll just see some scattered showers and storms into the afternoon developing. But cold front off towards our north and west that remains still off towards our north. It will continue to slowly approach our area. So we're still on the hot and humid side of that front for the day today. And they'll still be pumping in that threat for some showers and storms. To pop up this afternoon. These will be scattered, but a few of those could contain some heavier downpours similar to the setup yesterday. So we did that marginal risk for much of the area for that excessive rainfall outlook. So again, that's a one out of four on that scale. But tomorrow, we're going to be changing over to that slight risk because we think with this cold front continuing to push its way farther south and east, all this moisture will be moving in and we'll likely see widespread showers and storms. And some of those could be on the heavier side as well. So excessive rainfall outlook again tomorrow is a slight risk. That's a two out of four on that scale, and that's a little bit higher of a risk as we look ahead towards tomorrow compared to the date today. But future cast timing it out for your Tuesday afternoon. We'll likely see a few more clouds bubbling up and then a threat for those scattered showers and storms. Doesn't look like much on this future cast, but like yesterday, the models were having a tough time developing where some of the heaviest of those downpours will be. So just imagine that we'll likely see some scattered showers and storms through the afternoon and into the early evening before those fade away right around sunset. And then we'll see partial clearing of those skies overnight tonight should be dry as we get towards tomorrow morning starting off dry before more rain is on the way as that cold front will be draped across the area. We'll likely see right around noon a few of those showers and storms that bubble up tomorrow afternoon, mainly out towards the west. And then as that front continues to sink its way farther southward, we'll see more widespread uh, showers and storms. And some of those with embedded downpours, those yellows and reds popping up do indicate the intensity of that rainfall could be quite intense at times tomorrow afternoon into the early evening. As we look ahead towards Thursday, 7 a.m., we do have this front off towards our north and west yet again. That will likely be ushering in the much more pleasant air that will be moving in as we get towards Friday as well as the weekend. The heat advisory, though, today is mainly east of D.C. That's where heat index values nearing 105. But elsewhere across our area, we could see those heat index values near the triple digits later on this afternoon. Already starting to heat up near 80 in D.C., mid to upper 70s off towards the north and west. Dew points, it is soupy. We're seeing those dew points into low 70s, but high today back into the mid to upper 90s tomorrow will be right around 90 degrees but also tomorrow is a DMV first warm day here's a view of the rest of that eight day outlook mid 80s on Thursday far less humid for our Friday and that low humidity and pleasant air will be with us for Saturday and Sunday really a nice weekend on tap for any of those outdoor plans you may have but is it pleasant out there on the roads well Katie Ree is here to give us those answers how's it looking out there with traffic